right, so I'm here with our technical SEO director, Bill Wilkinson. Um, Bill, thanks for joining us today. Thanks for having me. For sure, for sure. Uh, so as many of you guys know, um, there was a recent Penguin re-release, the 4.0 version. Uh, I'm sure you guys have seen uh, that reflected in your rankings, your traffic. Um, so I thought I'd pull in the big gun here himself to kind of walk us through uh, what that might look like for everyone and, and some things you might want to know. So, so without further ado, Bill, do you want to maybe give us some points, maybe three or four things people should look out at or know about this new update? Yeah, definitely. So first thing is Penguin 4.0 is in real time. So that means it's integrated directly into Google's core algorithm and it processes every single time Google crawls your site. Whereas previously, Penguin was only released on scheduled days and would run for about a week, do its magic, and then you know sites would see the results. So with it being real time, there's a couple advantages and kind of disadvantages to that. The advantage is if you are uh, affected by this, you can recover from it much quicker. However, uh, you have to be much more diligent in terms of staying on top of your link profile and making sure that you're adhering to all of Google's best practices and consistently monitoring the link profile and weeding out any of the bad that's in there. Uh, the second thing would be that it's much more granular than it was before. So rather than penalizing a whole site, uh, it will only focus on certain pages and keyword groups. So that is good because, you know, obviously if your whole site tanks, that can be a huge loss to your business. Whereas with the new version, only specific segments of your site that violate or do not apply with uh, Google's Webmaster Guidelines will be affected uh, in terms of ranking loss and then also traffic. Um, with that being said, this version of Penguin, it doesn't necessarily penalize your site how the previous versions would. It simply devalues any links that uh, are not of high quality or do not adhere to Google's guidelines. Uh, so that is good, but it makes it harder to find it. A lot of sites right now, they're seeing some ranking dips, and that's because there are links that were previously counting for their rankings that are no longer giving them that authority and counting for their rankings anymore. Um, outside of that, you know, one thing that's kind of you know interesting about uh, this update is that it really is only uh, integrated into Google's core algorithm for desktop because if you look at the differences in ranking either decreases or increases for desktop and mobile searches, you only really see the fluctuations on desktop searches. Uh, so the reason for that is Google's algorithm for desktop and mobile are two completely separate algorithms, um, which is an indicator that they're likely testing this on desktop now, and then it will make its way into the mobile algorithm later. Got it. That's interesting, especially about the mobile bit. Cool. Well, yeah. uh, there you guys have it. That's pretty much the nitty gritty on the Penguin 4.0 release. Um, if you guys have any other questions, please contact us, email us at contact at powerdigitalmarketing.com. Uh, thanks everyone, thanks for tuning in.